Hello everyone. Something came to my mind. So let me say it. <laughs> In the past and not so long ago, depending on the case, I had people steal from me. I had people say, if you do this for me, blah, 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 I will pay you, blah, 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 blah. And in some cases, did not get paid. I have done things for people, and I believe I have done things for people, and when I wanted them to do something for me, they either did not really want to do it properly or some other mess happened. I believe that is true. With some people, if someone steals from you, if someone takes advantage of you, that may make you want to not really help anyone else. Do you understand what I am saying to you? That may make you want to think of some other people as potential users. Look, I think I have been used so many times. And I may not say this in a proper way, but let me say it in a way which I believe is biblically correct. We can't only help the ones that we trust or that will pay us back or that will like we can't only help trustworthy people. Do you understand what I am trying to say to you? We have to in I believe in many cases, we have to help our enemies. We have to help those that we may know will betray us. Kevin, what sense does it make to help someone that is going to cheat you and blah, 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 blah. It is the Christian biblical way of doing things. I may not have the scripture right, but I believe the scripture goes something like what reward or what good is it to help those that help you? Like don't the, let me say it like this, don't the ordinary people or the scribes or, <laughs> I get the scripture mixed in my mind, but don't the whatever tax collectors or whatever they are called do the same. But you call yourself a man or woman of God and look now, we have to help people who aren't trustworthy people that you know you may get betrayed myself if i only helped people that would pay me back or whatever i would only help <laughs> like maybe <laughs> few people maybe less than i don't know five or less Most people, I think, or should I say many people, I think, will do you wrong. That is normal. I don't like it. Like, for instance, 
I had a person tell me that at the end of the week or the work week, that person will pay me this and that for doing this and that for that person. Okay, that day came, that man never paid me, and on top of that, was talking to me as if we had no problem, like smiling and pat me on the back and stuff like that. Like, what is that? Like, are you trying to, like, you know you paid me. I text you about it, unless that person didn't get the text, but that person knew that they owed me and chose to not pay me unless there was some type of miscommunication, but I don't think there was because he paid me the week before. But treated me like, and what I done for that person, I think is worth way more than what that person told me he was going to pay me. I was very mad, I was hurt, but I kept on praying and praying until I calmed down. We all are going to reap what we sow. I don't have to go to that person's house and or where that person lives and do this and do that. I don't have to cuss that person out. Well, Kevin, you have to do something because people are going to think you are a doormat and treat you wrongly. I don't have to do what is wrong to get even. I don't have to get even. All I have to do is what? Treat folks right, do what is right, and God will repay that person. I don't have to repay evil with evil. God will take care of it. So, yes, you may have been taking, taken advantage of, yes, but that should not be an excuse to not help other people. Don't punish other people, which I have to point the finger at myself on that one, but don't point, don't point, don't punish other people for what you went through with someone else or other people. For instance, Sarah, Sarah stole $1,000 from me for an example, which is not true, but it is an example. So because of Sarah, I'm not giving no more money to anyone. That is wrong. That is wrong. Am I saying you should give everyone a dollar? Like everyone you see, give them a dollar? I am not saying that. But don't let an enemy don't let something that happened to you in the past stop you from doing good now. Please listen to what I am saying. Yes, be careful, be cautious, but don't be, but don't find a reason to be stingy. Let me stop here. God bless you.